Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Kerata kuli dumeri sababu boche kuche wanyama RBC. Amen. Kerata kuli dumeri salimu ruti this morning. Kerata kule boha also lead the committee of the church to give us this opportunity to stand before you so that we can also share what we know. Amen. Kali bitoki Julia Matebula. Those who know me, they call me Mama Tebula. Others they call me Maju. Um, everything is okay. Amen. Kyo kupa ribule di Bible zarona. Mo Genesis 4. Genesis 4 from 6. It reads as follows. Um, I'm reading NIV version. Then the Lord says to Cain, Why are you angry? Why is your face downcast? If you do what is right, will you not be accepted? But if you do not do what is right, sin is crouching at your door. It desires to have you but you must rule over it. Amen. Amen. Then I'm going to go back to um, verse 3. It reads as follows. The very same verse, um, Genesis 4. I'm just going to go back a little bit. In the course of time, Cain brought some of the fruits of the soil as an offering to the Lord. But Abel also brought an offering, fat portion, from some of the firstborn of his flocks. The Lord looked with favor on Abel and his offering, but on Cain and his offering, he did not look with favor. So Cain was very angry and his face was downcast. Amen. 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 Uh, from, from Genesis. The scripture is straightforward and the scripture is well known by all of us. This ones, they won't be suitable in the eyes of the Lord. Amen. And that Mahamata last week mentioned something that was very important. How much you are making on your tenders, you are the only ones that know. But on that money, if ever when we put you are going to rob God and you are going to give God that little one. And when I was like out those fat ones, and you put your credits first and then a what ohela um ten percent or tell me which is some more again it is the same as doing us doing nothing amen there was a time my husband knows um when it is month and actually there are some money that we do we do discuss amen but when it came to 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 the offering of the lord he knows uh, i i was not asking and he knows that he could not just come to me and ask. But we sat down and discussed. Because if you are married and you don't discuss such things with your partner, at the end of the day, if ever we were going to be punished by not giving, it means you yourself also, you are going to go to hell with him. Amen. What I'm trying to say is there are so, so some of the things we just need to sit down and make each other understand. Because of mind you, salvation is for one. During the end times... Mujimu Agasiri, your husband is the one that had brought you to hell. Amen. When we are going to be resurrected, you are the only one that will stand before the Lord and explain. Amen. And we are so blessed, Bazaran, because of God has given us all the senses. Just imagine others don't even have that opportunity to see. Others don't even have that opportunity to hear. Others, others they, mentally, they are not stable. But you have all these five senses. But sometimes we just overlook such things as to think for ourselves. Amen. Mara, as long as Muruti will mention something, we must sit as families. Riete, Rebale, the Bible scriptures, and then reconfess those confessions. Amen. Even though your partner does not understand, but if ever you do such confessions every day with him as family, at the end of the day, your partner will end up understanding. Hallelujah. Then I would like to to, to give a little bit of, 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 of my testimony. Hallelujah. It was the time of the tangible power of God. It was on the, in October. Hallelujah. I mean, so it, was, it was in September. Amen. So I was worried. I was telling my husband that um, 
as Julia that I know myself, usually I'm not a working type. Hallelujah. I'm the person that like to work for myself. Amen. But it came to a push where I was asking myself, like, yo, Lord, um, at this point I'm working. But when, what I'm getting is too little to what I'm used to. Amen. And we came here, we kept, we, kept, we kept on coming to church, we kept on confessing. And when the pastor announced that is the, the month of the tangible power of God, I said, this one, it must not pass us by amen. There is something that we do as a family. I'll, uh, most of the time, I'll be saying family, family, because of the, the people that I live with most of the time. Hallelujah. Then, during the tangible power of God, I was so worried, but what am I going to pay my son's school fees with because next year Arish he wants to stay in the dome. Amen. Then I was like, um, now in my family we take declarations very serious. Hallelujah. Then we I was like, the way we were used to to, to the previous issues that, that, that we were in. Hey, never declare we're taking them, so we would even fast on the word, hallelujah. Then I was like, this time I'm going to, to pray on this one. This tangible power of God is not going to pass us by as the family. Hallelujah. Then somewhere in the minds, they advertised something. Amen. Then I said to my husband, by advertising, I don't have um, the papers for Mara. I'm going to, to, to bid for it. Amen. Murti Salah mentioned something. Are, um sometimes they'll just put a statement just to put fear on you so that you cannot be able to may, may, maybe to beat or to apply for that particular thing but if also with that faith that you are having if ever you can just take that step of faith the rest of the things they will come after amen then even though you don't have certificate um i will go after when i've been called for, for the briefings and everything to do those certificates that they want. Amen. Luckily, guys, whatever that I did, and then I was called for the briefings, I went there. Then we checked the prices. Then I be there. One, two, three. Barry. Um, they are looking for a woman. Hallelujah. Mind you, nowadays, um, the man on this thing, they want to empower women more than me. I get And when they checked, I was the only woman that applied for that um, particular bit. And I was the one that was in Tabazimbi area. Others were coming from other areas. Amen. Mind you, I was not having what? The certificate that I was supposed to have. Then he rushed to wherever that he was supposed to rush to. He did that thing very quickly because of, they will give you a time. I get And then they called us. They were like, um, even your pricing, go and fix your price. And you fix the price very quickly. Then I send it away. But I was, I, I was also keeping on praying the tangible power of God. This month, it shall never pass me by. This is what I want. Amen. Amen. We kept on praying. I even called my children that kids come so that we can pray. This tangible power of God, it shall never pass us by. Amen. So where I'm sitting, um, I'm having the appointment. Hallelujah. Yeah. The things are already on site as I'm speaking. Amen. On the 20th, tomorrow, I'll be submitting my first invoice. Hallelujah. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Amen. But it's not the end of it. And mind you, even when I was up, I was not having a money. Hallelujah. Then the pastor announced the manifestation of the blessings. Amen. Get to the Gidiratang. Hallelujah. I'd rather not listen to any preaching, but when the pastor declares, that is so you'll see me standing up. I know that this is the time. Even if Muruti Gabalohori, Miwayakuru was so ever. But when the time to declare, when he declares, and you just go home and you, you practice on it, things come to pass. Amen. Mind you, I was not having the mind to buy the, the, the things. Hallelujah. And the email, they just called me out of the blue. Um, as the SLPs are doing what, 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 what you know, the language, our language, they, the minds. And they were like, do we have the, the things for the, for the set establishment? I was like, I, I don't know, but don't worry. The things I have delivered already, but I want one, two, three, so that I can send these things to the other side. Hallelujah. Um, as I'm sitting, I've got whatever that I've sent to them. Even the money actually is a little bit of replacement of what I've brought there. So they, they said that they will deposit it, but it is then in my email. There's no way they will take it back. As the pastor has already declared, it is there. It's, it's like I'm not going to lose anything. They are just supporting me so that I can give them, so that I can have my, my profit back. Amen. Amen. Um, I would like also to go to the Second Chronicles 9, chapter 9, verse 6. Hallelujah. 
They are a remember whoever so sparingly will also receive sparingly. Amen. Kyo nan twe irbu sata hape tu 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 kaine. Hallelujah. If ever you sow and you try to rob God, God is he's somebody that you cannot to rob. Amen. When we give, let us give heart-heartedly so and in a refer whatever percentage that um, is supposed to be given. Hallelujah. Mind you, the gospel is for free, but the electricity is not free. Amen. Amen. The water that we get from the church that we flush in the toilet is not for free. Amen. The mics that we are using is not for free. Amen. It's not like when you are giving, it's like maybe the pastor is going to eat your money. There, this, this is just some, some money that is going to be used to run the services of the church. Hallelujah. And when you give and you give sparingly so. Um, I like what also the pastor also like teaches about like Muslims. Hallelujah. Mind you, before I met my husband, I was a Muslim. I know the power of giving. Hallelujah. Those people, when they give, they give heart-heartedly so. Remember... They give knowing that um, when you are giving, you are especially to the poor, you are you are loaning God something. Hallelujah. There's no way God will never return the payment to you. Amen. So encourage when we give, let us give heart heartedly so. When I when I came here, I was a broken vessel. I don't want to lie to you. Um, there's a time that we decided as a family that we must we must just stay home and do not come here, to do not come to, to do not go to any church. Amen. We were so broken, but from the other churches. When I came here, I was so surprised. Like pastors doing everything for people. There, people will reap. Or I So the freedom that we are having in this church as royalties, though we are calling ourselves royalties. Um, Negeri, let us try by all means to assist because now, now what we are coming from, where we are coming from, though we are not supposed to talk about where we are coming from. But here, things are not like that. Let's not undermine because of you even run from here thinking that you are going to, to the other, that I don't know. You'll be saying that you are going to the other church where things will be better. Here on Wednesdays and Tuesdays, they teach us that um, the blessings of the Lord, the God has already blessed us, even if before we can we can say that, thank you, Lord. Amen. Mind you, if ever you can see that the Lord has even already blessed us before we can even say that we are blessed. But out of the blue, out of the blue, the Lord has already blessed us before we can even say that we are blessed. But out of the blue, you will never succeed, but at the end of the day, you have succeeded. Hallelujah. So, Mudimu already already blesses the soul. Let us give wholeheartedly so. Every church building, because there will be a time where maybe your kid will get, maybe, maybe will get sick. Maybe your kids won't be able to get jobs. You'll have to look back, oh God, where, where did I go wrong? And you find yourself that you are not giving. Bazalon, we are people, I get, and we, we have the thing that is called consciousness. And when you look back, as you are Julia like me, and see who I have not been giving, I haven't been faithful. Amen. Not well, my husband, he was like, things were not going okay, Julia, where were we wrong? We are not giving in the ministry. We spoke, we, were, we are not giving in the ministry. That's why we said, okay, let's just rectify this thing. Because of, we have tested God, and we see who God is always speaking every day to us. And God is always protecting us every day. Hallelujah. Amen. Then that leads me to the end of my, my offering. Hallelujah. And then...
motheho ya modimo ka lebitso le le matla lebitso la mopolisi Kriste Jesu ke tse le sebaka se ke di medise a ba senior pastor thabo mogotlane ka lebitso le le pahameng lebitso la mopolisi Kriste Jesu e ke tlo bala admonition ya rona go tswa go dipisa lome gaolo ya borobedi Psalm chapter 8 yona e buise ganjana ere Morena mosi wa rona lina la ga go le khalalela jang mo lefatsing lotlhe wena yo borena tswa ga go bo opelelwang kwa le godimong o itiretse itumiso e kgolo e tswa mo melomonya bana le ya masiya ka ntla ya ba ganetsi ba gago gore o dire matse ba ba le ba ipusolosetse ba ke lebile magodimo a gago tiro ya menwana ya gago le ngwedi le dinaledi tso di tlhomileng kana motho ke eng fa o mogopotse mwana wa motho ke eng fa o mabalela o motlaedi seditse ba eng gele go le gonnye fela wa morwesa khalalelo le bontle o motiri le molaudi wa ditiro tsa diatla tsa gago o beile dilo tsotlhe fa tlase ga dinao tsa gagwe tsotlhe dingkuli dikhomo le tsona diphologolo tsa naga dinonyane tsa le wa pele ditlhapitsa le wa atle le fa ele eng se se ralalang le wa atle ka ditsela tsa lone morena mosi wa rona kana lina la ga go le khalalela jang mo lefatsheng lotlhe a morena a se go fatse puiso ya le foko la gagwe amen Tate kimba ya ka kawena otswane twi kitho riso Tate kimba ya
God has exalted the name Jesus above every other name that ever mentioned on the name Jesus, every knee shall bow to the name Jesus and every tongue shall confess that Jesus is the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. before we get into the word of God the devil is a liar Jesus is the Messiah thank you Lord for your presence in this house this morning somebody see the modimo are really burdens on their shoulders and we know that at Calvary burdens have been lifted up I speak peace be still peace be still peace be still whatever the devil is trying to preach another sermon peace be still Thank you, Father, for the peace of God that is above all human understanding. We give you the honor and the glory because they belongs to you, my Father, in the only name that makes sense, the word of Jesus. Come on, just say this Bible. 
is God speaking to me I believe and I receive the word of God as the truth nothing but the truth for my life right now in Jesus name amen while you are still standing open with me Exodus chapter number four Exodus chapter number four thank you Holy Spirit that you are here now speak to us Lord we are listening in Jesus name thank you you keep him in perfect peace those that their minds are sticked on Jesus Exodus chapter number four we are reading only one verse verse number 21 Exodus is the second book of your Bible from the Old Testament chapter number four verse number 21 if you've got it let me hear say amen. amen verse 21 it says and the Lord said to Moses when you return into Egypt see that you do before Pharaoh all those miracles and wonders which I have put in your hand but I as God will make Pharaoh stubborn and harden his heart so that he will not let the people go jump to chapter number 13 we are reading verse number 17 chapter 1 3 verse number 1 7 chapter 13 verse number 17 thank you lord thank you holy spirit verse 17 then it says and when pharaoh let the people go god let them nod by the way of the land of the philistines although that was nearer for god said lest the people change their peoples when they see war and return to egypt verse 18 but god led the people around by the way of the wilderness towards the red sea and the israelites went up marshaled in ranks out of the land of egypt jump to verse number 21 yeah the same chapter 13 verse number 21 and the bible says the lord went before them by day in a pillar of clouds to lead them along the way and by night in a pillar of fire to give them light so that they might travel by day and by night verse 22 the pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night did not depart from before the people you must underline that part they were led by the cloud morning even in the night the cloud led them chapter number 14 verse number 9 chapter 14 verse number 9 my sermon on chapter number 14 verse number 9 it says then the egyptians pursued them them the israelites all the horses and chariots of pharaoh and his horsemen and his army and overtook them and camped at the red sea by pi hahithoth in front of bel ziphon when pharaoh drew near the israelites looked up and behold the egyptians were marching after them and the israelites were exceedingly frightened and cried out to the lord then they said to moses is it because there are no graves in egypt that you have taken us away to die in the wilderness why have you treated us this way and brought us out of egypt did we not tell you in egypt let us alone let us save the egyptians for it would have been better for us to save the egyptians than to die in the wilderness and moses told the people fear not stand still and see the salvation of the lord which he will work for you today somebody say today yes. for the egyptians that you have seen today you shall never see them again verse 14 this is the verse again the lord will fight for you when how just hold your peace and remain at rest that means just relax mudimu is fighting for you verse number 15 then the lord said to moses why do you cry to me tell the people of israel to go forward lift up your rod and stretch out your hand over the sea and divide it and the israelites shall go on a dry ground through the midst of the sea verse 17 and i behold i will harden the hearts of the egyptian and they shall go after them and i will gain honor over pharaoh and all his host his chariots and all his horsemen the Egyptians shall know and realize that I am the Lord when I have gained honor and glory over Pharaoh, his chariots and the horsemen. Verse number 19, then the angel of the Lord who went before the host of Israel, he moved and went behind them and the pillar of the cloud went from before them and stood behind them. Coming between the host of Egypt and the host of Israel, it was a cloud 
and darkness to the Egyptians, but the same cloud gave light by night to the Israelites, and the one host did not come near the other all night. Then Moses stretched out his hand over the sea, and the Lord caused the sea to go back by a strong east wind all that night, and made the sea dry land, and the waters were divided, and the Israelites went into the midst of the sea on dry ground, the waters being a wall to them on the right hand, and also a wall to them on the left hand may god bless the reading of his word in jesus name you may be seated in the presence of the lord the bible says the grass one day will wither and the flowers will fade away but the word of our god shall stand for ever in jesus name greetings in the name of jesus thank you for being here this morning we know that there were other places you could have been but the fact that you are here we don't take it light we try by all means to do justice to the cause that's why the bible says god rewards the people that seeks after him and guess what you are one of them somebody say me too the monthly morning get the monthly the manifestation of the blessing so that means the weight must become flesh the foundational scripture is found in proverbs 10 22 and then bible says the blessing of the lord it makes truly rich and he adds no sorrow with it neither does toiling increase it it referring to what the blessing of the lord dealing upon your life if if no stem from the beginning of this month we have started a devotion study family uh, late in the evening the confessions delegate is running at the information desk that the blessings will be confessing within your kids your wife your husband and all members of your family joshua Marara, this book this book these instructions of Fanzone, they must never leave your mouth or your mind or your heart or what your mouth because the mouth has been made to create things also in sony today as a result of the words that you spoke in the past so please pick up the confessions for are the blessing of the lord confess them it's just a revival it's only 10 minutes you just read it you close it or you keep it or you need to in the spirit but one and the one that i really look for a boy who boy monwana so that means somebody have a little injury alisa boy it's only the results is it total mobile pilong Bahao. Allow me this morning of the the 20th of October to speak to you on the subject titled The Cal de Sac is not the end of your road. Cal de Sac is not the end of your road. Cal de Sac, Balikile Laya for uh, drivers, Kanagi uh, Lenas, La Yongwala, Livizolo La Lavona, La Tahela, too much, La Cal de Sac. I love our area. I'm most trusting of it. Listen to the Mila Gazela. We saw the other day. Call the sack. It's a it's a French word which means end of the road. Arable like a end of the road. Arable like a T junction. T junction. You can still turn left or right or make a U turn. But call the sack. It means there's no left. There's no right. There's no going forward. There's no going back. You are just at the end of your road. The cul de sac is the end of the road. But guess what? The cul de sac is not the end of your road. That's where the difference is. Cul de sac, you're making kebo fellow but say la mara. Cul de sac, mon no gudu melang has a fellow for say la yaga. So please, that's why Jesus refused the Holy Spirit. Do you know why the Holy Spirit? Jesus and Alamul Fatsing, he was a hundred percent human being and hundred percent god he had a body like me and you so jesus could not be in different places simultaneously at the same time you know by the way hana boundary i took a passport if there's somebody in botswana who is sick by now i'm funyela kamurape lagafunu moyo halang o jampa bodara osna password so is the spirit that doesn't have any limit so that means the spirit enables you how rich are the cul-de-sac and i'm going to have a boundary and again at the third person or a machine to learn from it yeah that's why i'm john 16 is just so i think it's to your benefit that the holy spirit must come that's why i'm john 16 is just so i think it's to your benefit that the holy spirit must come because if you are you are going to be limited in what you are doing and i remember it to the fullest baba malona or the application i attend that or a miracle or go school on cc relay we made good regard why expect about or about a retail somebody are at here when not to last no sabi that those papers bolella moyo hala moyo hala naya ka ife lamo up to here 
it's up to you. O kono bolela le motho tswantseng a approve. Ane a sa tswana wa approve wena, mara moyo ha langa mo khozoro ba ireng ba fe wena that contract or o tsene o ne number 1 on the list because there's no distance in the spiritual realm. That's why kokwa 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 o la hana lawyer. Na kono ya Cape Town 2 hours o wili. And this is a magazine. If you want to go to Cape Town, you can't go to the supernatural. But why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Why do you want to go to the hospital? Okay. And then let me come to the middle of the thing. What do you want to say? I'm going to say that 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 I'm going to Confession mo hadi berege, muruja atwa no fuhu nela, au na lichumi yako mo fulanga tofa chelete. This is the end of the road. Tofa dile kawe na lona gele lebele taishi ngile loali. To the point dolo wana mara wushu kwa moya watwa mona me kono ta understand or kaldisak. It's not the end of my mara satano toko bonsa the end of the road. Or even bad report is designed to show you what I call kaldisak in your. Life and another whole and if you impression your Christianity, Omanati has no polos or everything. It was a mapilla, you've been crucified with Christ. It's no longer you who live, Jesus lives in you. When a man is in Christ, is a new creation. But all that they never told us, Christianity, Pila Pila, is not a bed of roses. Mudimu didn't promise us a smooth ride on this journey, your Christianity. But Sartre Piston Sonaki, his ever presence in our lives. That's why the Bible says God is our refuge and strength, a well proven help in time of trouble. So you don't have to quit just because other people around you are quitting. How about when I quit? Get called the sake of one has a man has a how. So sky to a whole year full stop. There are still many rivers to something with the cross. There are still many victories to something with the winner of Pilomba How. So, Scarlet Lella Boemo Bo, Buffet Ohe, or Cal de Sac, because Cal de Sac is the end of road for other people, but not for you, because you have been given the Spirit of God to open up doors that no man can close in your life. Now, how about the book of Exodus, chapter 3, chapter number 4? In summary, it's what we call the commissioning of Moses. Commission, it means to send out. Just like Arabala, Matthew 28, that's not just what I'm saying, I'm saying, all power has been given to you, to me in heaven, on earth, and even under the earth. Commission, I'm sending you out, guys. Go and preach the gospel. Baba Dumelang, Bakolobese Molineng, Lele Wane. Libito Lantate, Libito Lele Wane, Lamora, Libito Lele Wane, Lamoya, Asma Ina Mararogi, Libito Lele Wane, just like that. And Ababa Rarakito, Naluluna, until the end End of age. That's what we call the Great Commission. Is when Jesus was releasing the disciples to go out and minister the gospel. Le Abraham Genesis chapter twelve. That's what we call the commissioning of Abraham. Lo ena horun ne mo ne mo te mo is because you have been commissioned to do something on earth. And kam ko mudi muge maratanga ting. Akasi njajigan tu asan tu mangori kitu ye zamole falsi. You are not very missing in Christianity. God is going to judge me on what he has sent me to do on earth. Because he's fair and he's, there's no way I can judge I got something. So the judgment day you are going to be judged on how well you did what God has sent you to do. How about the parable? In fact, it's not a parable. Yeah, Matthew 25. Jesus will like the kingdom of heaven, how it operates. Come to me start I got the 10 visions. Baba Mbati Libatsuri extra oil. Baba Chiro Olinya Nenya 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 Nenya
na go etsamaile ba le mabona bona dima ba tsamaya ba yo batla o le ba bo wa bakirile monya go tswa letso monya di a fihlile sekale bala in christianity virginity reconnect the purity that means ba ba sadi ba bararo ba le ba sna sebe le ba sna sebe mara tebile re bakirile monya go wa le go di mo tswa letso ba lahlelwa ko ntle ko kitlanong ya meno how to lapile a rich man is going to a far country who is at 7.33 offer almost 1 5000 dollar offer 2000 offer 1000 about our guys go and do business with this money until i come back and habo wa o grele wa number 1 i double tse wa number 2 i double tse wa bara ro tsera yepela a ebi a mo tlasa mpeto and that modimo ena ha ta o batla profit it doesn't care about the talent you are feeling you and that parable i read the i read the kingdom of god is like this it is the kingdom of heaven meaning how you enter heaven follow that principle that's how you get into heaven so le lona le filo di talente ta dile mo di matlang ya go bona re o dabotse talente ya hao that's why sometimes ke na strict a motho a tlala because that talent you are wasting it and you are going to be judged on how well you practice your talent on earth so no no motho tenga ka tla fela kulumaka go nna sekono nna nga kulumaka go nna different le di koloi that's why are di tlhatse mo kawashe wa ona lo mongwe itse ngore o mo te mo tla semolana no toro ke amatwa thaisa ba mmitsa rasta e ka ro tlhatsing ba mo rata gore ba thoba mone go tha tlhatsitse go letsa dinka monate ya no royalty car wash re tsela kota e rasta e tshwere re tlisa mo gore ya no ba ba tlo ba ba tlo planta mo is gonna be and by the way god was telling me this morning or it's in serious wena le magwae it might start at the fundraising project mudim can develop into a, a million dollar business at all this tangible mara e tlhoka consistent and faithfulness e re ke le bolelele hona le koloi e one e le ngore ha sne ba itlhatswa yo ba bulela menyako yo yo tlhentse ba itlhoka hona le koloi e one e le ngore ha ba ka itlhatswa yo ba ka nna ba tlhatswa tse 50 mara e one sne ba itlhatswa yo ba bulela menyako mara e tlhokang consistency that's why lo wena ngudu letse ngole mofatsi iputse putso why opala ko na consistent for 12 months every sunday o tla kereke beside ma so manyalo and everything o na di sunday tse ding tso tshusa ngora ga jwa ke kereke mutwano ya saluni saluni ka sonta e tshwantseng a tle kereke nga yo no wonder why miriri e fofure ha ya because we lack commitment and consistency in the word of god you have been rewarded by how much time you put in so believe you me because why do why how about for one saturday get us little but mr the opportunity i believe life and i mean i mean um, uh, 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 time and chance uh, happens to them all it will like on that all of us all of us mudim or time and chance let my teacher who now one over the plant the motors room yeah how mwano ke na tlogolang menya mara ga rona le tlotse wa bitsa di tanda cop le ola wela nda list ya di tanda cop tshwane ntata o ka tlhoekile ba re ka go di plase nda tswae le fela ya ka ntwe re leng o khietse monya believe you me mudim there's something small that was tlisang into your life that thing and e tlo tla kana go wena re leng o tsea of wait ne ke bala sorry ke a ke a tla mo kana ga jogo ke tlese ya ma ke tsuru go di prika ya mara di tla felela by one of the students, uh, Negebala John, John chapter five. John chapter five, Kila Molitella Bethesda, and a baby learning a little in a little at an appointed season, Lifudue Meiti. Wama Tomoat and hang into the water is healed from all diseases. That's what they say. Ne? Now, how about Lingulu in a little at an appointed season? Appointed season in a appointed again at the Mudimu. No, it's not calendar. Any which month, what any? Or a come Monday, what it twenty one is October. Any, any. Ling a little to fulfill me. That's why the reason why you are so. That's why. But let's say by the barua, you are every day by issue a call it tamu. I ling a little satla, but we should talk high. Baba, at least in case ling a little satla today. At least the grandma to walk alone. I can okay. That means never say you turn ling a little satla ning into the pool. Let now we turn Jesus out and ning mo RBC. Are we it? Are we it? I'm not seeing a hard day, Mark. Well, in terms of breakthrough, you don't know when your breakthrough is coming. So, ne na mo na anang urlo fa kereke toy one or lila lelo one agir ba tuwana la malam hanch. Lila laga mo lefte mo di mo le bloki la ki kereke gajo ku kita bloko la laga mo righte kita babona ne kante ke lo ane le zati le ne le ngelo ilahau 
leta le tsogo lo kwang consistency ta tswa go manya ska la blame because private jet di lo na tla be le rasa muruto lo o driver go le tsa o tura o ba shile go tlase mara khale ke le botso re be consistent ali ye there's no wingalo fankere ke a khona ha and do you know how come pona ka 6 o'clock sunday morning o ka ba re demand ha yo re kor sunday yengwe lengwe ke lwala bolutsi bo bomba di hele tlhogo ya opa matswari re kuri flu yengwe ke tsaitse tsa ka modimo mo moya wa tswa monami mara net fela ha ke tsena ka monya go hola every ba ke le bana mo kuleng i don't know if they were away kare la ntata go ntlong ke start lo go hlola re la tenta tema tsa bo ke a go hlola ke o tlo go hlola tsa sahla mo pilong ke re se ka nalo wa comment nga tsona ba didi malebo bo ra tse ha se re fulwa mola ke non tsa fela tshiji fela ke iphumula ha ke tsena ka monya go hola that cough is gone That was the devil stopping King Peter along every Sunday by the way. I told me. That was happening to me because why it would have captured the voice. There's no way nga minister and I guess a minister is Kalevala Romans 10:17 faith it like a so that means house number 2 minister and I can hear anything. So that's what the devil does. So please kale kopela never ever take it light when you come into the presence of the Lord. You don't know when the angel of your breakthrough is coming into your life so christianity is not a bed of roses matata thing everything it thing now fine mudimu biza moshe o mo fa a mission eh botata ba this calling e bo imanyana eh skala ba la kratu bo mantswara when god calls you he also equips you for that mission akaso romele ko asa o preparing go te a khona ha Lange bele nna ke sa tsama ka 91 92 ke ntse motha ba zimbi ne le ka se ngutwa ke re ne ra ke re ramo le bona dinya tsa ka tse 15 ya no ka re ke tla pitura le zuri ke shile ba ka hai le mpona ke le skuno ko ne le le ngutwa so modimo wa go ntsa in your community o isa samwe o tsentsa go pateng o tlhatswa a tsentsa mo stay softing wa bua o tlo go planta mo a go ntsitseng mo te you can deliver the people for the system from the system of poverty ele wena o dependileng on it so you must go out so that you'll get something new into them so he equips you he prepares you for the mission now but tata wa moshe go re moshe o re aikre a le mote mo in the land of the midianites skala bala o tshabile go egepeta sinza bolaya one of the egyptians o mo brurwa ha ya ba motoro ska itira o mo betere mo rona re tla bolela fa ro ro bolai le o mo wa masola hai so how discover spirit says it really moshe atsaba sabo bedi moshe na le bothata ba speech was wa kana ke a motho go buretsa ka sekwa ke wa was tamara ke tamara o stagaring o some something like that so was tamara a khono bolela and then a tswantsa hai mar moshe o le be zintwe one for 40 years he spent in go egypt it was preparing him for such a time as this modimo o mo letle letsoro a gole go ntlunya faro I took the royalty etiquette how do you come before pharaoh what language of egypt are you going to speak to him i do in the years to come moshe is a very useful tool for me o go tla motse yang ke mmusetse back mara bo thata gore o tshabile kwa tswang go teng and wana ntate modimo nya go mmusetsa a yo ni go sheta le pharaoh to let the people go now in the midst of all this personal challenges the moshe adi face it eng more ba di le mo teng mo chapter number 4 verse 21 Mudimura Moshe Mura Moshe I'm going to make Pharaoh stubborn and I'm going to harden his heart so that he will not let go of my people Agizul na le bona bya something doesn't make sense there On Romela to a project when a mudimon Roma ko ena o tswalla menya gore ke se ka na successful ko ke yang ko te So when Pharaoh all negative is because mudim ke na ri leng ane negative so mudimo a ka romela on a mission mara at the same time he makes it hard for you to accomplish your mission somebody wa lwel wa lwala mo rogorogile mudimo wa rumor tsa maya o mo rap o mo rapela mara ntso mo rapela mudimo ke na iro re motho o aske a fola mudimo wa lo rumor tsa malo witness and the gospel to ba to ba go extension 5 ke ne tere tlo matenda ra rera mara the same god ke na tsa tsebetse di pelo tsa bona ro basketball ba sokolo ha ba thoba so mudimo o file mmele ko leng khalo rapela o greile mara ke ena khosa ngore wena le boso ya hao le sekela u tswana le lwane ile ena romile ngon that mission but he causes things to become hard 
for you. So Moses has been sent to go and talk to Pharaoh to let the people go. Mara guess what? Mudimu yana ilor Pharaoh aska cover the first time. Agar barba to cover the first time. So le Pharaoh akave the first time. Now why Mudimu atatafaza pelo ya Pharaoh? Pharaoh aska lokola batu. It's a question of power. I think I once preached a sermon airing uh, when when two centers of power collides, the lesser power must bow. I think I think I preached it somewhere. So when two when two centers of power the copana, I know the guy mella, the lesser power must bow. Little giants, I know the giants the baby, the galavella now macho. The lesser one must bow. So Urumu Dimali Kelefarwan Nestabon, it's a question of power or a kimang mudimu between na lefar. Who's God between me and Pharaoh? Now, if you remember the plagues, the Mudimari executing over the land of Egypt, Dinale, the relevancy to what I want to talk to you about right now. Just give me about 15 minutes, do an introduction, then I'm going to preach for 10 minutes, and then we are done. We'll be going home. Skalabala, Egypt, they don't believe in God, they are idol worshippers. Parabela Badimu in Egypt. Let's take a closer look at the 10 plagues the mudimari ntiteng de ya go eji the the plagues ke ke di le di tsanga tsona ke di go tlona di bitso ya ke di bitso the mudimari filen the egyptians ho yenka egypt on your bulletin i've made it easier for you baba le bele online will put them right now there so that you can see them ho na le mudimo wa nanyana wa bone o ba mmetsang hapi hapi ke mudimo ba ke tseditseng yene ke modimo wa the river nile purpose ya hai is to make sure or the river nile always in a le meetsi faro has a stupid everything mo bophelong ba hai we is it is an idol ever i worship and i always say if kin na ke rile pulpit ye i'm the creator pulpit is the creation why trans the creator i worship the creation but you move to one someone ever keep up on a baby reason one of a bit amara baba do mela so much or a hard one at the river nile overflow it means mudim war on a happy can i refund me so never meet them with you wanna what the nile river a supplier at the egyptian ska meet now koto yama tomo the first plague emu di maiti samu egypti o tenne meeti aning ali fresh into blood the reason why Afetola Mezian Nile into blood, it was a personal attack on Pharaoh. Limudim Wahai Hapi. Obona Hora Ab Mudimo Bamotsepango can reverse the plague. Abu said the Mezial and fresh Anura Hapeke the Egyptians. And guess what? Liga Joko Santander Mwemezi, I think I responded, Mudimwana Wabona Wa the Nile, Hofetola that plague, and Mudima Rumezi over the river Nile. Number two, Banabanale and Idol. Ebay bitang hey cat hey cat ke their idol we long hore merkwa hai it's a goddess of fertility water and renewal those names are there on your bulletin so merkwa hai ne lo make sure ba sadi ba rona ba na fertile le di pofolo tsa rona di na fertile metsi ya ranwang at line and then renewal man ho ntshafatsa lwena mo se moyeng sa hai that's why le tlhogo ya hai ne ba ire le tlhogo ya hai e tshwane le tlhogo ya Yes, because nearly mudimwana on a mona like that. So mudimu hene arliza a plague. Yeah, the frogs then indeed led to Egypt. It was a personal attack on Pharaoh and also this little god here. He kept who wanna hor ana agarivers at the plague. E mudima ba romezi nyone go Egypt. Then guess what? He kept never came to party. Mudimu had to withdraw the plague himself. Number three. Banale mudimu wana wana ba mizang geb, G-E-B. Merekwa hai was to look after the dust of the earth or the soil of the earth. Or this dust can be fertile. Merekwa hai ko meika shohore, the dust is rich, it's fertile enough. Now, ham moshe abitza mole fatsin ka kota ya hai ebe hotwa de lais. Lais ki matzaisa, ki laisi ma matzaisa ne? Like mon beton hao sa ukuluma ki beton al dos bit whatever parts or whatever tell division zero so matetsa atenela to the egyptians abaluma and everything why mudimu narumela a personal challenge towards pharaoh limudimu anawahai gap who won out this idol 
can it really reverse the plague that you're meeting over the nation of Israel? And guess what? He never came to party this guy to stop all those things. By the way, by the way, for your information, all these plagues, the Mudimadis and go Egypt. Go Geshon, Adio. Geshon, give me the Israel station, the model. In South Africa's context, there are how many provinces? Nine provinces. Are really Bobo, give me the Israel to Balem Mote. Ha, South Africa will have a target, Allah, Runaga Morshab. No problem. I mean, Jan Nile, Ava, Retu Quali. Ha, and not for a more bothering a Gishon, Astaton Nasco, nor Narcon on the other side. Then the fourth one, by Rilimudiman over Mitz and Capri. Capri Gimudimana, what creation? Gimudimana, what control and the movement of the sun? And a Gimudimana, what control and what you call rebirth? Like Ugilwan, one Nalangwana, Pilobat and one Omohabe. So Capri Gimerqua High, Mudimana, oh, that means O controller, how the sun moves, O controller creation. And as I eat them, irrelegant at the Mudimo. So Hunter the Mudima Liza, the flies didn't see. It's in into the length of Egypt. Diba diba na mele energy. It's irritating. Kur langa ta wun kunya ha wan kista na mo abile mo nate ka granchi ka mo harige a kora same time. It's one a little fair. These two things I can't stand against them. So I mean I can't stand for them. Now Mudimu Haru mele dinti te he was sending a personal attack on Pharaoh and his idol Capri. O wana hurricane. He reverse the plague that God has sent over the Egyptians. Guess what? Ba ile ba mo rapela. He never responded against them. Come, call the team. They got to get hustle. But the mobile one, let's say, let's not go. Who are visa one? Now, go. Come, call the team. Let's say, they got no busy way. Pull up by the mobile one. The fifth one, Mudi Mwate Naba Misa Hasso. Merakwa Hai Nele, the goddess of love and protection. So that means how to call the rato. Ota ufalo Nabi Le will protect you over your life. And we rang happy. Troya Hai Nabi Le Troya Hai. It's one Nabi Le Troya Ya Homo. This goddess of love and protection. So Mudimu Harumela, the pestilence, le 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 robo robo. Modi komunze nendi ligo Egypt. He would do as a personal attack. Enengai Rumela directly to Pharaoh and to Hathor to see to it. Or if their trusted God is so powerful, let him reverse all these things. Or the powerful ones are going to escape the Ashwa. And guess what? She never responded. This idol. Number six. By really Mudimu no mumba miza Isis. Isis was a goddess of medicine and peace. So that means how Allah by a koye and again abafang podiso era abafe peace in the land. So when God aromela the boils, kana kastona libizan gidi so tela jiri na leng baluniya na so kana libizan baluniya na para kengi di pull or something. So all the Egyptians, but you lady so this was attended as a meeting. I'm having a little one. What for Tonya? So it was a personal attack on Pharaoh and uh, the idol Isis to see if this God can reverse this plague. And guess what? He never responded until God withdrew them. The seventh one, Banal Mudimu Abanova Mitang, not and you tea. I want to look at again. I don't want to get again. What you are not so so Nat was a goddess of the sky, meaning who control everything that happens in the heavenly realms. So Mudimu Hana Rumela the Hail Sefako. The Egyptians at that time it was a personal attack on Pharaoh and the idol not to see to it. Or this God can he really reverse this plague? Yeah, the hail. And guess what? This idol. Never responded. The eighth one, Banal Mudimu Ono Wanaba Mitang Seth. Merego was says is the God of the storms and the God of order. So that means Mudimu Hana Romela the locust di chie. This Alamut Wot Sewako Egypt. It was a personal attack on Pharaoh and his idol Seth to see to it or can he reverse the plague. And guess what? Liga Jogo, he never did anything. For the ninth time, by really, Mudimu Abonaba Misa Ra. Ra is the god of the sun. So that means, can I control the Zili Tavaning, the Zazi Lewela Ning? So Mudimu Haru Melali Fifi for three days, let it cover the whole town here, Egypt. By the way, Lififi Latin as Lififi Laruna Lausihu. Lififi Lelung Hori. Haki Mimo. Mamle Mana Mimola. Laga Tumatoshi Haki Boni. 
That's how dark it was in Egypt. So that was a personal attack on Pharaoh and the idol Ra to see to into can he reverse God is the God of the sky. Can he cause the sun to come down on the Egyptians? Guess what? Bamurapeti, he did nothing about that. Skalebala, I will make Pharaoh's heart to become stubborn. This is part of the stubbornness. Why? It's a question of power. And I'll the ultimate power. The tenth one, which is very severe. All the firstborns in the land of Egypt. This attack, it was on Pharaoh and Pharaoh alone. Because the Egyptians, Babona Pharaoh is somebody one alone, the ultimate power. How about the Pharaoh? But the ultimate power. In our context, the Balibility, oh Matawoche, Almighty. That's how they saw Pharaoh. So Mudimo Haru Mela the Urili Fulobaya, I mean Lingelula Fulobla, the firstborn, telling in the vicinity of Egypt, it was a personal attack on the one ordering his almighty go Egypt. The regular would say the same almighty who palet to go say even when I have a firstborn. As Kavola Giling Lula Leaf. He couldn't stop it. On himself, or stop a viance alone. A palisico stop a sinning, deliver land in the salapa la high. So every plague, Emudi my roommating in the land of Egypt, it was a personal attack on Pharaoh, Leba Dimwana, Bobo Chebana Limbone in the land of Egypt to prove for he is God Almighty. And Oscalabala, it was God who hardens the heart of Pharaoh to prove to him or the Egyptians Bagana wanna all almighty Mara Nagi Fita into the room. I become the almighty God in our lives. Now to fast forward, Hasne Banabashwa, Bay Lemabiting, Bailo Boloka, Pharaoh, Kahu Kapeini, then he decided to let the Israelites go by to the Promised land. He gave up. I don't know. I don't want you in my land anymore. Let's go to chapter 13, verse number 17. Here, the book of Exodus. The firstborns have died. Now, Pharaoh has said to Moses, because of the pain of losing. The one who's supposed to come on the throne. I want to be like in that or may I lose the firstborn son in the family because the firstborn son is the one who will hurry haki before he show he release the blessing upon them. Verse number seventeen. Are you hearing? Amen. Here, when Pharaoh let the people go, God led them not by the way of the land of the Philistine, although that was nearer. For God said, lest the people change their purpose when they see war and return to Egypt. Verse 18. But God led the people around by the way of the wilderness towards the Red Sea. And the Israelites went up, marshaled in the ranks out of the land of Egypt. That tells me, this is the India to the promised land. It's a bit. Two ways, then India to the promised land. The first one, it must go via the city of the Philistine, and that was the shorter one. The long one, it was via the Red Sea, via the wilderness, in order to get into the promised land. But Mudimu allowed the Israelites, but here the longer route, Baskebatia, the shortest one ever fit and come out the Philistine. And Ugalabaka la Mudimu Lere, Uri, it all had the Philistine Baba Ateka. Egypt. to the promised land. Why? Because for a long time. The problem is not because Mudimu Hanya Mudimu is not convinced. On your commitment in following him. The reason why Asaba Fitisa Morale Fatlava Felicita is because I have a tip with these guys. But I never you tell about Lamarao go Egypt. So that's why I have a the long road 
mara luano yo ba fitsa mara ona ke tsela etelle yo fitang ka the red sea the reason being aba tsepe ha tsepe their faithfulness or these guys hanga ba blesser ba ilo ira u10 or ba ilo tsamaya lenna so lo ena ngutlo le zenga jeko there are some things don't do the rappella for some time adi rahale mudimo doesn't trust you why you zoro tswana le the prodigal son e doras na go fa zaga e bo tsamaya re tla bera o bona next year this time e lona o bo wa chelete if it deal so god made them to take a long route because he was not convinced of their readiness to engage in a war lo hore ba tla tshepala ka nnete a ba feisa mathata hore ba khono fitla go ba yang go teo skalebala god will never send you on a mission e as how preparing ka yo mathata ao kopana lone a go le ka ne a go le ka yes when you might feel heaviness trust me a ho le ka ntse ke le morutu wa hao a re swa pedi tlhago ka be ke lla within 24 hours or no tsedi an kimela di boima tse a go le ka ne a go le ka ne se fa pano so so roeleng se monna ha re mosadi a hao o go le ka nka di mene fela for 24 hours a 3 hours is enough ka be ke chief ka go tsia mosadi ya wa tsa mae na mo thong ta o o go na hante ka na mara o le ka ne wena Now meanwhile in Egypt Pharaoh had a out of anger on his decision on Tama Sola 600 or Arba Salem Rao those guys bagar tlwela blind we are going to kill them in the wilderness abale motsile my point again just because we win round 1 it doesn't mean the battle is over round 2 is coming can i repeat that one just because you destroyed the devil this morning skanana go fedile another chance is coming for the devil to attack you that's why gradol botor after every victory there's a devil waiting for you on the other side of that victory you know thata bar na re celebrate that yele yar e ka re christmas te ha e tla wane mongwa heng has no winner how one round one round two is coming the devil o to recall ba bo happy I talk about a lot of the temptations and I find Jesus. Matthew fully look for, by the way, he recorded the same incident that Jesus was raped for forty years and forty nights. Ha! So Satan no more can get Allah. Trial number one, for two, Lama tapa we respect to Oje. Trial number two, Om Namah Jagori Matava. Psalm ninety-one, here you can dive on top of the mountain and the angels will come and carry you. Trial number three, he took him and he shows him all the wealth of the world and he tells him, if you bow down to me, I'm gonna give them to you right now, just like this. Then half it, Bible ere Satan outwitzi Jesus until I create an opportune time. Yahuwa ha peruto tempta Jesus. Leva le. I think in Luke chapter four verse thirteen, Satan outwitzi temporarily until I mela another opportune time to come and tempt Jesus again. So skana hanore how we win nega jokun toye ifedi le. The devil is still recouping. He's coming back. Again, that's why I get to let the party to premature. I remember that the last local election, Rona Ma NC, we need to watch it's eleven out of twelve. Let's have the bell. Can the formula ya easy? One plus one, I do go for the pillow more. Are there now? I rush out to come to move on or risk a radio cancel. That's why we pass all these. Nengabo lela feda marakan until December, just like that. So premature victory, premature victory. Be careful of that one. Fine. Chapter fourteen, verse seventeen. Let's go there with me. Skala wara ya feda nuga no. I'm speaking on the subject there. Caldisag is not the end of your road. Yeah, Caldisag is not the end of your road. Verse seventeen. The Bible says, "And I, I can tate mudi mu. Behold." I will harden the hearts of the Egyptians, and they shall go after them, and I will gain honor over Pharaoh and all his host, his chariots and horsemen. Who the Lord Pharaoh had not decided to arm us all tomorrow? Mudimu again. Can I tell the father and pillow of Pharaoh or assail the Israelites tomorrow? So the Atoba Bolaya on the road. Now, Skalabala, did you see that they went to the Promised Land? There's a shorter one. Mara shota wane bo thata ba wane ke e ka nna ya e tsore ha re fetsa di challenge re boelle morao mara the longa wane le ona na le mathata a teng the longa one the first stop se ba kopana le sone ke the red sea and a chance ba jambe the red sea to go to the other side so that they can reach the promised land 
mara yanu gora haba ka swima mo le watle le watle lo ba kometsa ha ba lebella ko borao ba bona faro le masola hae ba tla ba nyaka go tlo ba bolaya ba ba tibisitse at that time so as, as i've said if but the solution number one you are they are going to drown and die on that sea if they decide to go back the egyptians are going to kill them that means the israelites are facing what i call kal disag this is the end of the road almighty ah ashuli shile yanu o le beile mo le watle tsela ya the philistine yes ne le shotha ne ro feisa ntwa mara ne le betere tsela ela that's why mudima go re le ngutlweleng anything you will create young premature in ala mathata ate remember every blessing e tswang mudimo it is good there's nothing bad about it mara how we create prematurely in ala mathata ate so i'm thinking for example here the single mothers and single fathers la re ga se bolele mo kereke go thata go godisa ngwana o le wa especially in tata ha ya tswana le faro a thata fa di tsepe ka o sane ngwana o ha hola mo strateng sona se gata mo re khona se se mo ganne ke sona se se mo tsore mo nakana ke nnang tata mara you are not there when this child needed you you rather you rather exclude yourself forever from the life of this child ka ro wa mo wa mo confuse yo bri wa jure bo tlhoko yang ona yana ke tsala tsoko la pele kwa mo hotlane go tla ntato mo Armona papa was papa o kenna papa and jeve sa ke re bona tshwane le tsaka di mane e no change everything ene ngi dumela moyo e change everything so anything we grab prematurely in ale mathata ate mara ela ya dry o kana nor modimo o lebetsa o lebala ne he is still perfecting you or how to an authority for the blessing you won't spoil those blessings like what the prodigal son did it's good le falela ke le hai mara o le grey le before nako and the first sign you want to are already for wealth ke lo tlele ke lo tlele tlhlhonya ba le bitsa athletics fit or something eh wa le a tia lo lona le eh ka mahare ka mo le ngwa ya o jure ngwa ya eng eh o mmone mo thatswa ra chat le le statong ngape ha tsa male sha pa le a le a le tsima ra hanna stele la ngwa first three boats wa mo wa move ya rastenberg wa nna kwa le la ngwa ya wa move ya magalis wa nna nyana la ngwa ya wa move ya four years la ngwa ya wa move ya kron stata la ngwa ya wa move ya blomfontein la ngwa ya wa move ya kimbali la ngwa ya wa move ya cape town o tla ba tsena inside the ocean e bo cross o ya somewhere because of what le tola ha o la hlotlonya ke ona sign ya bontsho you are not matured and mo dima ba re ha o sa tshepa le motse nyane tso go fanzone you are not ready for millions that's a secret of becoming a millionaire be faithful on the little money that god has given you la o planta tolo ngile ga le botsa ga ene ke re ntato na hola 6000 mo kereke ansa thai ta tsa pala tsa kereke everything was okay then muruti a tla ntato a a mo blesser and ntato la gra promotion overnight a start a hola 10 times the amount a hola 60000 ya no hana hola 6000 thai finally 600 that one it was easy now o hola 60 tswantse o ntse thai fele kana le salary ya hao ya khale 6000 6000 6000 kana chelete e create mabaka la bona le jekere ke ntshule han ka ntsa o mvula ka le fa 100 100 100 100 ba ba ile ngwe ntsa di 10000 tsa di thai they are not even more than 10% the rest of you go na le tswile le tsa mail mara han o tla kerekeng o no o sa expecta or o tlo grea mara how no we grea in le ma baka ke bona bo thata ba rona bona bo so the israelites on that were give us again e ba mo promote a gra 60 as na gra 60 ya no re ka ko yem chakala and everything di ko lotto di start on na higher than the income asaniela o la tanta de muruti ta de muruti e ke na le bo thata man aish ko to sa re gitse dintja ke sekona lo nela le le thaifi dia dia ngha Alright, that the murita re tla rapela ba tswalla mahlo ba tshorana ka matso. Eh papa I made a mistake. Hane ke rapela this man o mo fa promotion. 
Hana hola six thousand ki 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 motha pilo mai dewe. Hana hola six thousand na atse pahala aniela six hundred. Riri le po so ramuna mele tora hola six ti ano pala kon sale thay that six thousand. Are muse the mona li bifo murudar a men and dole gas to patha pilo abasi mulla honcha thay. The mudi mo o testa gade small anya ko wana hora are you ready for the mountain top? And a satani we enjoy a toily. Why enjoy a toily? Satan o kono lo atsangwa na furu nda izu ra ona medical like amon o mondo no wana wa so ene che envelope a chike tsweri ene wana wa so envelope ke wana wa ever wan ai ai manya na bill o dia chelete u isa kae u isa wana o dokte kan de taisi ene ile go bofa cg se se tsweri wana ha o alwala no wonder why we are playing your one like this for the rest of our lives. You know why? We allow what our eyes feed us to determine our faith in God. That's why Samson because of So now the Israelites are faced with a cal disag. And by the way, if you're not aware, cal disag I did in voice. Can I repeat that one? Cal disag I did male. In a lay voice. Kaldisak will tell you, you have tried all within your power to get out of this situation, but I have failed. I give up. That's the voice of Kaldisak. Kaldisak will say, you borrowed money from Paul to pay Peter. Lanzo Feliza Yalo, the Gordo Zahao, Dinti di Paila Abomodi Mari, Fukuse, you rather give up everything. That is the voice of the Kaldisak. Kaldisak will tell you, you went from one therapy to the other, the counselors battle to save your marriage, but now, Jay's what what for? Like it's a kunwe bolela G A T. I I give up. Mole nyalo le ketsenza divorce. Enough, it's enough. That is not you. That is the voice of Cal Disag. Cal Disag will tell you, Kalolo ala we let spetlele by le operation it's a fifteen mo million wahau. You you can't seem to handle the pain anymore. Let deep down in your heart you are praying. Mudi mo I lor my mission of edile. Take my spirit away. Let me die. Enough. It's enough. That's the voice of Kaldisag. Kaldisag will tell you, I've tried everything in my power to convince my family. Muruto refile the confession I see. Di unle kira pina le masari aga le monaga leva ana. Maro you don't know. Lagi ba kupora ba kwen joina ba yaku joina. Kena kira pina ngi le one on this family devotion. They seem uninterested and they disturb my spirit. That is not you. That is the voice of Kal. Disag. Carl Disag will tell you, I've tried everything in my power to be good and a faithful Christian. That's the voice of the Carl Disag. You see, I know that Carl Disag it means the end of the road. But God has sent me to announce to you, or the Carl Disag is not the end of your road. Mara is the end of their road. Baba lenga round well. How about Bab stop? Ba give up. Luena don't stop and give up. Ki bo fellow ba bo ne namon na ke santane ke chuen la pili kia kopili. So call this act generally is the end of the road. Mara na omu di man rumi len for a mission. Oke chua wacha mole fatsing. Whenever I face a call this act, this is not the end of my road, but it's the end of their road that's why the book yeah psalm 91 here, thousands may fall on your side ten thousand may fall on my right hand only shall i be a spectator that's why david or i've been young and now i'm old yet i've never seen the righteous forsaken or their children begging for bread today call is not the end of your road but it's the end of the road of other people that's why one song right already. I can't just give up now. I've come too far from where I started from. Lonala Boma Figizola Mozalon and Nakala Ritsuere Zilera Samale Jesu. Maras, from the first day, nobody told me that the road to Christianity would be easy. Until one in Moplunaga, don't believe. Or Mudimu was simulating the good work in me. 
Oto ntwa la kile half big Timothy Lane. No 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 no. Yes, I'm seeing the end of the road. Mara mudimo wa samile the good work in me. He will bring it into completion. No matter the loud voice of Kaldisag, what it says into my life. Come and look at somebody. Tell them Kaldisag is not the end of your road. All I want to ask out Mister Namufasi Mulevele. The Kaldisag is not the end of your road that's why paul and one of the romans ate what shall we say to this cul-de-sac if god is for us who can stand against us it's not me who makes a way on the cul-de-sac mara i don't have anything to say to this cul-de-sac yes bam for of it in a bad way the bubble did he cast sorry go fell like a certain age in my life and i've arrived at that age and i can't borrow or can't need it they told me the truth mara mudimu yeah and he's able and pitisa on that cul-de-sac so don't take it personal that's why when he commissioned joshua he told joshua joshua a picture now no man shall be able to stand before you all the days of your life i'm gonna walk with you i will never leave you and i will never forsake you because cal is not the end of my road one songwriter or i thank god for for the mountains i thank god for the valleys i thank him for the storms that he brought me through because if i never had a problem in the first place i would never know that god can solve these problems i would never know what faith molinjul lamudimo could do for me that's why i get to make you go pela gar ke half a go pela pine one can take it through it all and through it all i've learned to trust in jesus i've learned to trust in god through it all and through it all i've learned to depend upon the word of god lela pa o ba na ba o gapa your siblings ba o gapa mara the bible says jesus is a friend that stick close than your brother Caldisag is not the end of my road I'm going somewhere also I'm calling the movie Shadrach, Meshach, Lee, Abednego they faced their own Caldisag in the form of a fiery finance but the God that they serve he came through for them at that 11th hour how some to mail it a move to Paul and Silas they face their own cul-de-sac in a form of a prison term but the God that I serve he came through for them how some to mail it some of it that David when he faced his own cul-de-sac in the form of Goliath and Saul but the God that he served he came through for him how sent to mele some of us daniel he faced his own cul-de-sac in the form of a lion's den but the god that he served he came through for them some of us said joseph he faced his own cul-de-sac in the form of family rejection slavery and prison term but the god that he says he came through for them lua and amudimo moseva he will come through for you Kaldisag is not the end of your road. Yes, Bowfila divorce decree. Don't don't sign it yet, man. As long as Antonio Bilver Lignano Lemu di Mugolana lo Deni Ling, don't sign that thing yet, man. The doctor told you bullet wobble training, it's a chronic illness. Bow wants it the evidence for about a pill for months. Yes, that is the Kaldisag. Don't allow the voice of the Kaldisag to determine the mission of God upon your life. On Alamoria Mudir Molito, don't give up now. Verse number 19 in chapter 14, if you are still open there. And the Bible says, the angel of the Lord who went before the host of Israel moved and went behind them. And the pillar of cloud went from before them and stood behind them. Remember, since Batwako, Egypt, they never moved unless the cloud moves in the day the clouds provide shelter in the evening the same cloud it provides light for them so that means 
GPRS ya bona ging ke tetlao ke tetlao in our context mo yo halang a botor tsa mai oske wa wa tsa mai but now because the egyptians are coming u ka bebelere ere the very same cloud it's we le kopile haba israel ya ya ko morao ha bo it moved that law mele go pila bona ba leader mar when the enemy is coming behind you that loud moves from the front it like i to the bear fine why 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 verse 20 that loud came between the host of egypt and the host of israel ke go ba la slow on our revelation that loud came between the host of egypt and the host of israel it was a cloud and darkness on the side ya the egyptian but on the side of the israelites it was light by night to the israelites comma and the one host did not come near the other host all night let's hear part of it and one host did not come nearer to come in close contact with the other host so that means when the cloud went behind the israelites number one it was to prevent the egyptians baskeba fichella the israelites reason number two it was meant to prevent the Israelites. Okay, let me repeat verse 20. And the one host did not come near the other host all night. So, the protector the the Israelites from no 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 ne ne stop Are you aware how the first stop? the first stop the first stop the first stop so that's why lingeloi Nelly Lo block at the Egyptian scale of Italy, Mara, the second reasonable trope, Nelly Lo block at Boneva, Baskebera, U10, Babu Lamra, Gobatuang, Gote. So next time, Hanzo Rapella, Eva Satolo, and Anta Temudimu Copilla, how Oscana nor Hayo, how who is because of Bumrao, how Honale, Babam Banja, the Rate, Halavan says the Morao, who busy Gabo, no Tilagabo, and my pain. Let them shout, let them criticize, let them scandalize your name. God is there to help you on that situation. That's why the right of the song is through it all. Arahan kebeke sa feta in the valley. Nje beke sa yuturu mudimuga nito wa fitisa in the middle of the valley. That test is meant to create a testimony on the inside of you. Fine, fine, fine. Kya fit? Eh, kema gina nga otorari tla pika di huku? Or Ota Mileva Motor Chapigadu. Okay, fine. By Rangabaz and Awal, Kiwuku, Le Ping Yelago Pile, a baby, a button say. Button tongue? What is a baby of a very good? Very. Why? Baby is meant to deceive the fish. Fish, I won't who hook will so. You never know the worm as a bait, come on. You never fell a bona. Languages, isn't it? The worm is a bait, and then whenever you look at it, the fish, you can catch it right there. Now, what's what's my my point here? You see, Mudimu he afisa the Israelites ba fisa na le the Red Sea. Mo bonen nele kaldi sag, mara mo Mudimu it was an opportunity. Ya horeng abulets ila motzele sa buleheng mote. Aye, it is a fella by Israel. We just a le bonen the Egyptians. Skalbala kena tata fadi zempelo. Now it makes sense how David Are he prepares the table before me in the presence of my enemies. Pila Pila, your enemies Hanaba create a VIP invitation to your event. Bonet they thought or whatever honor about about to join Mara, that invitation served as a worm, which is a bait. 
so that haba fitla o khono bona the destruction ya bona mo pele ha macho ahao so the red sea was like a bait to the egyptians mo bana no roba tswara mo teng mudima ba rixa the very same sea to destroy them not once but forever in their life there will never be mention of any pharaoh again in their lives marabona they were not away or the red sea was just a bait for them lastly the miracle was not the parting of the sea eo yone modimo khono he za itsweng le na ka butsola metsi mo a shifta ya kwa ya mbote that one is normal the miracle go robats a mile on a dry ground that is the miracle of the whole concept that's the miracle le watle le ba fetsang go le bula ene le ngutlele mbebe le fetsa re Bebere elene holy busi. I was not away. I gave a la maven. No holy busi. Adam Adam Mushara, Adam Mudimara Mushara, stretch out your rod to the sea. It was in the night in holy busi. Holy busi. It was in the middle of the night. So that means there is no way. Me muola ogo tasalo wate no ka umaga tengar le tazi ala ala sha. So the miracle go about crossing on the dry ground. It's not about God open the Red Sea. For them, so from today, scatolo personalizer, bantim baso tsware handle, bako trita biambia. Mudimu is busy working in them, and he is making them more stubborn and more stubborn and more stubborn. But what alone? I don't feel like I'm armed. I go to my real empty labila and says, "Oh, it's one more to another day." We're not there. Give Mudimu about crossing, but ne more stubborn, more stubborn, more stubborn. Now, if you turn your lamp, but you want to see what I'm about to say, you see, Mudimu is not very stubborn, but ne more stubborn, more stubborn, and more stubborn. All the allegations are what about the internet last year? But I can't even come and go to Morocco. I can't turn my real lamp. You see, I'm trying to. God is the one who's making them more stubborn. More stubborn. One day you'll be facing the Red Sea. That Red Sea is not meant for you. It's a bait for them to come and drown in that Red Sea. Marabu tata ba how you took matters into your own hands, and God cannot move right when I move. Let go and let God handle that situation for you. It doesn't matter how big is your problem. I'm here to announce to you that cul-de-sac is not the end of your road. But it's the beginning of your journey to the promised land. You can't get there unless you go through the Red Sea. In Jesus' name, Amen. I can't finish the sermon. Karo ko tsela ba bandi revelation, but I'm tabo mohatla ne and I approve this message. It's done in Jesus' name. Rotoira, rotoira di confession ke ko paasha slin tusonal confession ashi di mo. That the blessing of the Lord, according to Psalm 91, we're gonna make those confessions right now. Uh, the reason why I read these confessions, uh, but we're gonna confess the protection in this way. In Jesus' name, let it run. In Jesus' name, so that we come and make this confession. In Jesus' name. Ha ke sa helwa ki di lo unte ku kulaka unte la kari pulelo unte la kari Se paki isabu akere kimo futana akere kimo kimo futana uri uri che.
lift up to me just say my heavenly father i praise you that i dwell in the secret place of the most high god and i remain stable and i am fixed under the shadow of the almighty i will say of you you are my lord you alone you are my refuge you are my place of safety you are my god and i trust in you for you rescue me from every trap you protect me from the deadly diseases you cover me with your feathers you shelter me with your wings your faithful promises they are my shield they are my protection i'm not afraid of the terrors of the night i'm not afraid of the arrows that flies in the day i do not fear the diseases that pursues me in darkness i do not fear the disaster that strike at midday though a thousand may fall at my side ten thousand at my right hand these evils will not touch me my eyes shall be open to see how the wicked are being punished no evil no evil no evil shall fall on me no calamity no disaster no pandemic no sicknesses no premature death no theft no witchcraft no curses shall come near me nor my household for the lord has instructed his angels to watch over me to accompany me to defend me to protect me wherever i go your angels they are carrying me with their hands i won't even head my foot on a stone i will walk over the lions i will walk over the cobras i will crush the angry lions and the serpents under my feet because i have said my love upon my god therefore my god will rescue me he will protect everyone who trust in his name when i call on him he answers me he is with me in the time of trouble he rescues me and he honors me and he rewards me with long life and he gives me his salvation somebody say my life will never and never and never and never and never be the same again somebody shout come and look at somebody say it is done it is done it is done, 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 yeah. It is done. Yeah.
your hands towards me let me bless you may the lord keep you may the lord bless you may the lord make his face to shine on you and give you the favor that you don't deserve may the lord lift up his countenances on you and give you the shalom peace of god that is above your human understanding father with the authority that you gave me i place the name of jesus upon their foreheads even in the palm of their hands everything that they find to do this week it shall not fail but it shall prosper i come against the kingdom of darkness i come against the legion of demons i come against every agent used by the devil i silence them right now they are bound powerless null and void before our very own eyes the grace of our lord jesus the love of god the fellowship of the holy spirit be with each and every one of us until we meet again in the only name that makes sense the name of jesus thank you holy spirit you are worthy lord to be praised let's meet again uh, on sunday and may god bless you amen Uri you na na